welcome back to a, another video update on a blade. Um, in the past uh, few days and two videos, uh, we've been working on the, the hard top. Um, as you can see, we've added the, the top uh, raised you know, supports or roof, raised areas on the roof, however you want to call it. <laughs> uh, the roof humps, I, I don't know. Um, but basically, uh, these humps, their main function is just allow someone like me um, to have a little bit more headroom uh, for helmets and things like that inside the car uh, and just be more comfortable in general. So um, on top of lowering uh, the seating in the inside and creating extra room, uh, now we've added that some extra height uh, to, the, uh, to the roof itself. So it's been raised about an inch and a quarter, uh, probably be raised a little bit more by the time we're done. But basically, um, this kind of gives you an idea uh, what, it look, what, what it's looking like at the moment. Um, still have a lot of uh, sanding to do. Man, am I tired of sanding. <laughs> uh, it's only 112 degrees out right now. So uh, anyway, um, basically, we've got to add some body filler to the roof and smooth it out and really establish uh, what lines the roof's going to have and everything like that. So. Um, that that'll be after this and stuff so right now we have to add on the, the rear portion of the hardtop you know the back of it's been cut off quite a bit we're going to add these little little rear wings to the top that are going to wrap around um, back to the flat glass so all in all this top will be a lot lighter than it uh, generally um, or i mean originally was in the first place so that'll make it easier to take on and off and store and all that stuff so so anyway uh, there you go. That's what the back's looking like so far. Um, like I said, still have a long ways to go on just about every aspect of the car. So, <laughs> uh, but really, um, we're, we're pretty close to, to having it molded. We just, right now, it's just a lot of labor and, and tweaking the body lines. So, um, just getting everything right and perfect and, and measured, and then we can go to uh, have molds made. So. This process is probably going to take a while. It's not exactly exciting, but um, but it's going to be worth it uh, in the long run. So uh, I'm really wishing at this moment that I had a nice five-axis CNC machine. So anyway, um, I guess uh, I'll keep you guys updated on some more videos uh, with the hardtop and other sections. Um, we have some uh, other supplies, metal and steel coming um, to support the the body itself onto the frame that we have inside. I know you can't see that at the moment, but there is a, a frame inside there, or a chassis. So, um, so anyway, almost wiped out. <laughs> uh, so anyway, I uh, just uh, wanted to give you an update and I'll, uh, I'll keep the videos coming. Later, bye.